quick note, um, please make sure that your telemetry is logging. Um, you can do that by, you can ensure it is doing so by checking your setup menu under the electronics option um, and setting telemetry laps to 99. In terms of the schedule, server will be is booting up as we speak. Um, it will open up with a 15 minute practice session just to allow everybody to hop on, after which it will take over into a 30 minute qualifying session. Remember, when exiting the pits um, and while you're on an outlap, yield to those coming up fast behind you. Regarding, regarding faster drivers coming up behind you and qualifying, rule 7.4 states, priority is always to be given to cars currently on flying laps. This means that cars on outlaps, inlaps, or invalidated laps are expected to give way and not impede the performance of the passing car. It's also advised that the faster drivers view the track map before exiting the pits to ensure that they're not putting themselves out into traffic. Essentially, keep an eye on your deltas and pick your gap. After qualifying, we'll take over into the race session. It is a 60 minute or one hour long race. Uh, as always, it is a rolling start procedure. Just follow the on-screen instructions. Make sure to click drive to uh, early enough to avoid starting from the pits with lock controls. Um, as always, blue flags at SRSA are advisory. It is the responsibility of the driver uh, uh, being lapped to drive a predictable racing line and it is the responsibility of the driver lapping another driver to ensure a clean overtake. Um, if you do want to let someone by due to blue flags, please do so by pulling off of the racing line on a straight and doing a quick lift. Pit stop requirements. Um, we're requiring one pit stop uh, with a minimum of one liter of fuel. There's a 40 minute pit window. It opens 10 minutes after race start and it closes 10 minutes before the race ends. So just make sure to get into the pits before then. Penalties, lap one, turn one incidents. Uh, we as stewards take a dim view on that. Just give one another the, the enough breathing room. It is a very tight and twisty first few corners. It is known for causing some pileups. So be extra aware. Uh, watch out for speeding in the pit lane. I believe it's a stop and go penalty. Excessive cuts will also may, may also get you drive-throughs you'll get three warnings and on your fourth cut you'll be issued with a drive-through penalty regarding incidents if you do get caught up in an incident um, and you feel that it was your fault yield the position to the other driver or drivers involved um, we try and encourage a gentlemanly uh, form of racing here so so the quicker you you can get the people back on track and get battling with them the better uh, if you do feel hard done by um, with a with a incident, you can head on over to the log incident channel here on Discord. Click the button; it'll open up a channel. Um, make sure that you have the relevant onboards and, and external camera views on in the video link that you can share with the steward or team so that they can pass judgment if there is judgment to be passed. Please refrain from using chat during race or qualifying. I am aware that we aren't broadcasting, but it can still be uh, a, a, it can still be a bother to some drivers, um, and we do still want to have a line of communication with drivers in case some force majeure issue crops up. Uh, last quick note: Misano's pit lane, the pit line is very late in the pit lane, so be careful when coming around that corner. There might be cars going slowly, but know that the, the line is further down the, the, the pit lane, so be aware of that. And then when exiting as well, um, the, the cars currently on track, you may end up running wide into someone if you're not careful. So just be aware of one another there. Anybody have any questions? Please feel free to raise your hand and I'll pull you in and I'll invite you up to the stage for a quick question. Cool, it's late in the season, everybody knows what's up. Uh, let's go out and have a good race then, everybody. Cheers. How's it, Yuri? Hello? Hello, 
Hello? How's the fridge? Yeah, hey, how's it, Yuri? Lekker, man. Lekker. <sighs> Good. Uh, no load shedding, I'm assuming. <laughs> no, thankfully not. Fantastic. You're all clear. Stay behind the line. Your brakes are cold. Be careful. What time's you getting around here? My best is a 149.7. Okay, that's good. Huh? That's no, the stream is jumping again. No, it's it's very annoying. I haven't been able to stream lately. I don't know. What's it? Something on the config or what? You think? I don't know. No. Stutters badly. That's strange. But I mean, it was working before, wasn't it? It was. Ever since I upgraded the hardware, though. It takes it is clear. Don't cross the line. You're clear of the incident. Green I've flag. That you, Blue flag. You the hardware, didn't you? Yeah, I changed. Be it should be better, you know. Yeah. <laughs> I can't drive like this. I'm gonna have to kill the stream. Shame, man. That's actually sad. I would love to see it after the fact. Yeah, me 